Hey, what's up guys? I want to share with you how I set up a triple monitor with my laptop because I like compact things. I move a lot. That's why I'm using a Dell XPS 13 and this is very small. But when I come here at my place where I edit things, I work on multitasking work, I need a bigger screen. So I have a 21 inch monitor. Both of them are Acer. I don't know which brand you have right now or you, what you're planning to buy, but that's, that's a bit big enough for me to work on multiple things right away. So the thing is, when I come here, I'll just place my laptop, then plug in the, the device that I bought for both of these and this one. So uh, basically most of the times I only use two of them and kind of disregard this screen of the laptop because it's kind of small. And the other thing that I took advantage with doing this one is I get to use a keyboard, a dedicated keyboard for for like a more ergonomic kind of setup so that it's easier because using your laptop, um, it's kind of the keys are a little bit small and uh, well compact as well. And I also use a mouse. So you know the, the concept of this, you can drag the window to each window, but wherever you want to like that. Uh, the good thing is it's dissected in each screen. So I have one window here, I'll have another window here and then I'll have another window here. So I can just go and jump into each kind of work that I'm doing. Yeah, let's go ahead and I'll show you what I did. So I got this from Amazon. Let's go and pull it out of the box, your manual. Then here's the device that you need. So it's Anchor, it's a type C port because my laptop is type C. Then this is the two HDMI port, one type C port, light indicator, card readers for micro SD and SD card. Then you have two USB ports. Okay, so if you're only looking for a dual monitor, you can also get this one. It's 50% uh, cheaper than what I have. It is from Anchor as well. So this is how it looks like. As you can see, that's the price. Now, this is mainly towards uh, for multi-display only because, yeah, you only have two ports of HDMI. As you can see on their advertisement here, then that's how you can use it, okay, for Mac, Windows. This is the version that I got. I chose this one because of those extra ports that I can use. So, they call this one as the 8-in-1 because you have an Ethernet cable that you can plug. That's one gigabit additional USB ports and card readers as well aside from that dual HDMI port. I'll have the Amazon links down below so that you can just jump in and check that one out, okay? So these are my cables, they are ready already. I have the two HDMI cables from my monitor. I'll plug the first one, then the second one. Then both of these USB ports that I have here is for my keyboard in my mouse, so it's like a desktop kind of thing that I mentioned earlier. Then let's go ahead and plug this one into my laptop. Once you have plugged this one, this is working already. However, we need to change some settings so that they will be arranged properly. So you log in, then here on my computer, I'll just go ahead and right click, go for display settings. Then as you can see, the arrangement of this is not uh, that uh, correct. So we need to do it sequentially so that the flow of the mouse is from left to right. Let's apply the settings and then we can scroll down to check more settings. So you can see it here. You can choose if you want to duplicate the displays, use one and two, or like just what I do here, like extend the display settings, okay? So you can see it here while I'm using the computer that I can drag the windows from one window to the other and the mouse is going from left going to right. It's not kind of jumping from window to another window. Like what I've said, it should be sequential so that it will be easier for you to use. Well, of course, having bigger screen and multiple screen to work on, especially if you're a multitasking person, helps a lot. So there you have it. You have your one, two, and three. That's just about it, guys. If you have learned something from this video, don't forget to hit that like button subscribe if you haven't because i'm going to do more content like this and help me make a dream of 100,000 subscribers see you in my next video bye bye